Happening here today, we're holding High School Hackathon. It's an event for school students across all of the ACT. We have around 120 students participating in it this year, and they can either learn new skills through our beginner streams, or they can come down here and do what's known as the Advanced or Open Hackathon, where they work in small teams to build a digital product of their choice over the three days. These kids are like completely engrossed in like advanced technology from day one. Like these guys are picking up things that I didn't know until I was like 18, 19. In here we have nine students and five teachers. I've learned more than I thought I could learn in two months. So over this weekend we pretty much rushed them through all of the basic principles. There are people 3D printing robot hands downstairs. That is like mind-blowingly awesome. I chose to create a hand that was programmed and controlled by a robot. So some kids are actually creating things from scratch uh, using the Tinkercad, which is actually pretty darn cool. Uh, I've seen a train come out as a digital file. Uh, I've also seen other kids come out with a little tool to create uh, a little Stig thing on cocoa for your, your coffee. Doing front end and back end type stuff. Uh, so we've been teaching them uh, all the different languages, so HTML, CSS, JavaScript. And Nathan's creating, creating an app to help him uh, schedule his homework. Um, Innes has created a website about a cat that enjoys cheese. So yeah, I'm working with one of the kids and we're making a uh, Maze Runner type game. I'm using a Flash engine and I'm writing it and coding so that it will bring up a player and a map that the player can run around on. Started off with just a simple Space Invaders game and then we slowly moved towards more 3D games such as Asteroids and now um, we all get to create our own um, game of our choice and I've chosen to do um, a little game where you have to fly around in a plane and go through some hoops. And every day, like, I've been hooked to my laptop, just really wanting to get um, further with my game. And I just enjoy it so much. We're making an app for the Pebble Smartwatch uh, to change the colour, the brightness, um, turn the lights on and off uh, for the Philips here. The team that's been helping out of volunteers has just been great. You know, some of them have expertise in different fields that we're trying to figure out problems in and they've just been able to come along and help which has been really, really great with creating our app. The stuff we do now makes so much more of a difference in the future and the fact that we're getting help with it here is just, it's incredible because it means that we have so much potential in the future.